Good morning. We're at the Encore. It's 6.30, 7 a.m. It's time to get up, put some water on my body, and begin heading downstairs for the uh, WPT Premier Meetup game. <clears throat> Let's go. Let's go. Okay, I am up and I am showered and I have ordered breakfast and I will eat that and then I will get downstairs and I will get into this meetup game. If you've ever been to a meetup game before, you know that play is pretty non-standard. This one was made even more non-standard due to some bonuses the WPT threw in to win raffle tickets. The stakes we were playing were 2-5 or 1-3 no limit, and us ambassadors removing from table to table every 45 minutes. Full disclosure, WPT was reimbursing us for our buy-ins and we were instructed to have fun. Keep all that in mind as you watch and think, this should be a fold or this should be a raise. And did he really just shove all in with that? Welcome to the WPT Premier Meetup Game. Welcome. There you go. I'm good, and you? What did we You want me to be on your vlog after you wrote that shit on Instagram? Look at your hair. So luxurious. If you guys want any advice about your hair care, let me know. Thanks to everybody who showed up. Uh, poker players aren't uh, known to be too comfortable, but this is the biggest turnout we've ever had. Brian pretty much covered it here, but again, just want to say thanks so much to all you guys for being here. The first table I joined was a 2-5 game, and right off the bat, it seemed like a good group of fun-loving people. The meetup organizers wanted us to buy in for one to $200 in order to make all-ins and calls frequent. I'd completely forgotten about this at my first table and sat down with a full $1,500. Oops. That being said, I was still in don't play optimal mode, so my larger stack size didn't really matter that much. Here I looked down at Pocket Kings in the low jack and opened to $15 and get quickly raised by the cutoff to $50. Normally a spot that I might find a 4-bet in, but it's a meetup game. I call. 896 with two spades. I check and he bets $35 and although I should be pretty far ahead of his 3-bet range, I just call. The turn pairs the 8 and gets checked through. The river Ace of Hearts is a disaster. I know this, and you watching at home, you know this too. I check again and he bets $75. Seven. I will pay you off, sir. See? I'm the fun player. The very next hand, we open A7 all suit in early position and get two callers. Queen, eight, five, rainbow. I check as do both the low jack and the cutoff. The turn six of diamonds, however, this gets no check. I do the opposite. I overbet from out of position into two players. $150. Whoa, 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 hey, 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 hey. 
they both fold. You know, we're just clicking buttons today. I play three hands in a row, and in this one, I open a $20 without looking at my cards from the under the gun one spot. The low jack calls, and the button just moves all in for $135. Knowing that the raffle and the 10 deuce games are on, this could mean about anything. I peek at my cards, see King Jack of Diamonds, and announce raise. I'm not going to lie, I was completely blind. <laughs> I, I was completely blind. Raise. Raise. Although I only throw out $200. The low jack quickly folds, and the dealer runs out the board. Oh, I get a oh, ticket. Oh, you get a ticket. Yeah. Yeah. You're so nice. Oh, really? You get some ticket, oh, yeah. Uh, oh, oh, my oh. God. Oh. Oh. Wow. Well, at least you got a ticket. Right. At least you got a ticket. Our villain doesn't win the pot. I do. But he gets a raffle ticket. For the prime event, you well, I got what I wanted. Thank you so much. I would just say, short back. <laughs> Sorry, man. Don't worry. Ah, yeah. oh, we're getting ready to admit. All right. We're getting ready to admit here. Yeah. You too. You too. Good luck. Good luck to you guys. Hey, Good luck you with your non-vibrating toy business if you bring it back. I had a question. Like, shoot. When you when you shoot your vlogs, how long does it take to go like actually get posted? For every for every minute that you see in my vlog, uh, it takes me about an hour to edit. Uh, yeah, normally like two weeks. I normally do one a week. Four chips than when you still have. I'm playing blind. Playing blind? Blind, like you know, I'm playing three flat blinds. I bumped into Rampage as I was moving tables, and he was surprised at how many chips I had. Then reminded me that we were supposed to buy in short. Oh, that's right. So for the remaining tables, I bought in for as little as possible. Well, just full disclosure, I'm going to try to ruin your life for the next 40 minutes. Don't blame just, me. Just so you know. Don't blame you. <laughs> At least I want yeah. a ticket for losing all my shit to you, if, right? Yeah, if you walk out of here and say, I'm never playing poker again, then I, I did my job. <laughs> <laughs> that ain't happening. About 20 minutes later, I open pocket tins from under the gun and get calls from the low jack and hijack. Nine, five, seven with two clubs. Normally, a clear spot to continue betting. But I check. The low jack checks and the hijack bets $25. I just call in the low jack folds. The nine of hearts turn isn't my favorite card. I check again and he bets $45. I call again. Neither of us must like the eight of diamonds river card because the action gets checked through. And I lose to jack nine suited. Who? Oh, oh, wait. Right. He's a good reader of people, sir. He's a good reader of people. That was dope. Are you uh are you vlogging any of those like the ten twenty games there? No. Cause I'm smart. Like yeah. I'll mention it, but like, I don't really know. Yeah. I did a couple times here, the 10, 20, 40 here, like, and it's just not good. Like I'm just giving away too much information. You're giving away I'm money. giving away a lot, yeah. like a, a how I'm thinking and how I'm playing. And like, money yeah, like even when I, even when I vlog like five ten, like there's hands that I see that would be great for the vlog that will never make it on the vlog. Really? That's pretty smart. Yeah. I would like never have, like that's not like. It's like, like the meta of it is huge. Like It's like not obvious that you're doing that. Right, so. <laughs> right. Yeah. Like there's certain things I'll never show on the blog. Like I've, I've never showed check raising the river as a bluff, for instance. Like I've never, yeah, I, you know what I mean? Like I've never showed it. That's pretty sharp. Yeah, <laughs> like never going to show it. Not going to show you what I'm doing it with. Not going to show you if it ever happens. Like. Thank you very much. Well, it doesn't happen. Yeah, yeah it doesn't happen. <laughs> I just have it. There's yeah, because there's definitely a meta to it. You want to know? Want to know a fun fact? What? Do you want to know a fun fact? Yeah, yeah. 
I'm winning this hand. This one right here. This hand? I'm winning it. This hand right here. Yeah. No. Let's test that. That's, <laughs> you want to test that there? <laughs> I got position of nothing else. Doesn't matter. <laughs> Unfortunately, Doesn't matter. probably nothing else. <laughs> <laughs> All right, they're gonna make they're gonna make me blast. They're gonna make me blast. I'm winning next hand, you know. Yeah. <laughs> the next <laughs> the next hand. Yeah. Yeah. Never trust me. Yeah. Light up the building, raise up the torch. They want the power, I got the source. Signal the smoke and bring in the boys. Pull the alarm and bring in the noise. Can't keep quiet when you start a riot. Got the whole tribe on the other side. It was all good, then you drew the line. You gon' need a G shot, boy, you know the time. Danger, danger, just flew out the hangar. Back to my old tricks in the next hand. Open blind again to twenty dollars from under the gun one. I tell you, and do you want it? Or oh yeah, uh, twenty. The hijack calls, the cutoff calls, but the very relaxed button isn't falling for my hijinks. He three bets to one hundred and five dollars. For some reason, I thought I had about three hundred dollars in my stack. So when I peek at my cards, see king queen offsuit. and move all in, I'm kind of shocked that it was closer to $500. Yeesh. The button calls and we are going to need King Queen all suit to do some work. Seat nine, give a second, thank you. You beat me out of a hand, fair and square. Fair and square, well, yeah. no, 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 if there's fair hand, you get that. <laughs> My buddy Jonathan Vibrations has arrived. Hey, bud. I didn't know for the longest time that uh, Andrew was his brother. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> totally different personalities. Right, exactly. Totally different. Ain't no way. Yeah, yeah. I've never met anyone as zen and chill as Andrew. Like, it's, it's, it's ridiculous. Like, you could stab him in the throat, and he's just like, uh, <laughs> yeah, sometimes that happens. <laughs> My time was up and so I moved tables. At the next table, another at 2-5, the WPT began passing out a coffee mug to each table. The winner of the subsequent pot would win the mug. In one of the early hands at this second table, from the low jack, I call a $15 open from the under the gun two player with pocket fours. And the big blind comes along too. King, king, jack with two spades. This is checked around. The four of diamonds lands on the turn and the big blind now leads out for $30. Bad timing, sir. The under the gun two player folds and I simply call. Okay. Look at that. That's impressive. That's cool. <laughs> Pick this man a mug. With his face on it. With his face yeah. this time. When the Ten of Diamonds hits the river and the big blind checks, I just move all in. I mean, either he has a king, which he doesn't, and he'll call, or he was bluffing, and he'll fold. He folds. I had it. Come on. I had it. <laughs> Going to do a quick update. Three tables in. I can't win a hand. I can't win a damn thing. But this table, this table is primed to double, if not triple me up. See this kid? He's going to give me all of it. All of it in the next three to four hands. What part of Ohio? Uh, Columbus area. Oh, okay. See, I grew up in Cincinnati. I've been all over. Yeah, now. yeah. Columbus, Cincinnati, Cleveland. Yeah. 
Travel all over. Better black, Table four. Another new table. This one won three. And here the under the gun player opens to $15. You know, your standard 5X open. And I call from the big blind with jack three of spades because why not? King four eight with two hearts. I check and he continues for $25. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. What's that? I don't know. If you were checking, I was betting. I don't even know what's up. 30 bucks. I can't beat that. Ship me a coupon. Ship me a coupon. I call. I call. I call. <laughs> he got me. Double straddle. That leaves a triple straddle wide open. Yeah, come on. You know what? You know what's so good about this mug? It's that they put every good content. <laughs> they did all of them. All Only of them the are there. <laughs> all of them are there. Another mug pot, and in this one, the under the gun player has straddled to six dollars. I put on the double straddle to twelve dollars, and then look down at queen four offsuit. I don't win the pot or the mug. So how much help do you get right here? Your, this your, your blog is so it's just me. Really? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. I mean, it's just so visually amazing. Oh, thank you, man. There, there's a Christmas. Yes. Thank you. Yeah, I just, yeah, it's just all me. Yeah. And your music selections are good. Yeah. Thanks, man. Yeah. Yeah. Center was coming yeah. to this table yeah. and then to fly to all in yeah. by uh, seven juice. <laughs> and then he went. That's funny. <laughs> That's <Here>. funny. <laughs> Hark. My being's present should forewarn thee of the fate that unfolds anon. Yet ere I reveal the unfolding drama, let me commence with a prologue. At table four, amidst the stakes of one and three, a tale is spun of Nimi, bold and blind, triumphing with seven and two. Thus, picture our mirth as I, in contemplation, spy two monarchs adorned in scarlet and sable. Four contenders, each pledging three in coin, set the stage, and now the mantle of decision rests upon my shoulders. Swiftly, I cast forth all of my tokens, a hundred and forty-nine from the lesser blind. The greater blind, undaunted, matches my bid, compelling the others to retreat in surrender. In but moments, the tableau unfolds, the king of clubs, the nine of hearts, the three of diamonds, the four of clubs, and the four of spades grace the board. Lo, a full house emerges, and thus my foe succumbs to the inevitable, defeated in this contest of chance. Sorry, man. That's a little overkill. Oh. <laughs> I wanted everyone to just the bolt. Needed that. Yeah, I know. I wasted a full house. If you only get so many full houses in your life, I just wasted one unnecessarily. I'll tell you another one there today. I was talking to Rampage earlier. He was like stuck three. He was stuck like fifteen hundred after like half an hour. I lost. I lost three buy-ins in five hands. I'm walking around. Dude, dude. dude, what are we doing? I had it. Don't have it. What the fuck? I actually How do you not know this? How long do you find don't have it? Well, then another person. Yeah? Hold on. Come here. Yeah? Is he coming? Yeah, he's here. He's here somewhere. 